everybody today we are um, we are not unboxing but we are going through a little bag I found at my swap meet see this bag this bag filled with a ton of mini figures and action fig figures as well first things first this slime which is, which is supposed to be lava I think for like a baryonyx set yeah, it's pretty cool looking. It's not it's not the best thing in the world, but it's nice and squishy. But let's get into this bag right away. Let's just dump out everything so we can get through this. Bag. Let's look at this baggie first. So let's just screw everything to the side and make a little this bag. Now, this bag looks pretty cool. Of course, you can see a lot of things are right inside of it. First things first, you have a stand, and then you have a T Rex head. I'm not sure how to put the T Rex skull on this. But there's some cool things too, like this. Not sure what this is supposed to be. If any of you, and if any of you know what this is, please tell me. Don't know what this is either. Not sure what this is. I know this is a baby T-Rex, pretty small. And um, something that can fit. Um, blue figure for comparison on how small this thing is. We have a gun. We have this baggie. Another gun. And an, um, what looks to be a med kit. Not sure what's in it. Nothing's inside of it. Anyway, that's that bag. Pretty cool stuff inside of it. I like it. I'm probably going to use this a lot. Now let's get on to the bigger figures. And then we can move on to the mini figures. First... Up, we have this gyrosphere, which is pretty cool looking, especially if we spin it. The chair stays there. It's pretty cool. And then we have, of course, our blue figure, which is which is a pretty nice looking blue figure, to be honest. I really like it. And then this cool looking Dilophosaurus. I love the darker green by its eye. It, the reds and green mix in really well with it. And then we have a ginormous Stigimoloch, which has this uh, over here. Which you can see its flesh. It's pretty cool looking. He has some horns on its head. It's a reddish color. Some browns over paint over here. Time to get into human figures. Of course, human figures. A ton of them. Love them all. Human figures. Okay, so we have this guy. Not sure who he's supposed to be. Uh, forgot her name, but I know she's from Fallen Kingdom. Of course, we have Claire. We have Owen Grady, but two times. We have this guy that tries to steal the teeth from every dinosaur he sees. And then this woman that, um, says, I forgot, that she's supposed to be a nurse or something for the dinosaurs. Now, you have been waiting for. I don't know, most of you have been waiting for. Everything else in this bag. This wall, of course, was in the bag, but let's put that on the side because nobody cares about that. We are here for all these minifigures. So first up, we have this cute looking baby Mosasaurus. You can use this with your other huge Mosasaurus and pretend like it's a baby. Any of these mini figures you can use against, you can use with the big figures to show that it's like, it's like a baby. You can paint this in fact to make it look like a bumpy, but it's pretty cute looking. To be honest, like you see that? It's pretty spiky as well. In Kylosaurus, a very, very cool dinosaur. Now we have a clear Indominus Rex. Not a big fan of how it looks, but it is a cool sculpt of an Indominus Rex. It's 
I like the Indomitian Rex without the quills on the back of its head. It just looks better. It just looks way better. Anyway, more detailing on the back over here. Next up, next up we have the Carnotaurus in a weird looking pose, but it's one solid color, which is, I guess, okay. Like everything, most of the other things in this baggie. You can use this with the other Carnotaurus to make it look like a baby Carnotaurus. And then, of course, this small looking Tyranodon. Tyranodon. And yes, again, baby figure, I guess. It's pretty cool with its detailing. I, I don't know how, like, probably like the mystery bags you get this from. But yeah, that's that. Of course, can't have anything. You can't have baby blue without anything else. You have to have baby blue without anything. Because baby blue is the cutest thing out of everything in here, in my opinion. Just look how adorable he is. Or she is. And of course, we have the bigger blue. Nicely detailed. With the blue stripe. We have two different triceratops. One, sol one solid brown, one solid green. You can have this as little baby ceratops ends. It's just the horns are a little big and they're pretty cool looking. And then we have the Tyrannosaurus Rex. In other words, Rexy. Of course, she has a ton of detailing on her. A lot of detailing, in fact. And she looks pretty cool looking. She has a kind of transition to a darker brown or red to her back. And then, of course, we have the Indoraptor looking beautiful and fantastic. Never really was a fan of Indoraptor. It just looks like a Utah Raptor to me. Standing on all fours. And then, Baryonyx. I actually love how this one looks. The detailing is well done. And it's in a cool looking pose. Next, we have not everyone's favorite, but the Allosaurus from Fallen Kingdom. And of course, the blood marks on its side, I guess. There is no yellow coloring on the back, though, like the other one, the bigger one. But it is a cool addition. Then, of course, you know how we have a big Apatosaurus now? Now you have a little boy. Now you have a little Apatosaurus. Which is cute and adorable. Of course, it looks absolute. It looks so small. It's so cool looking as well. With all the detailing. Of course, baby Dilophosaurus. Not actually a baby Dilophosaurus, just a bit mini, but you can see where I'm going with baby Dilophosaurus. And then with a few figures left are the Stigimoloch and the Stegosaurus. Stegosaurus. I guess looks cool. I, I like it. Not that much though. Pretty. pretty these ones are eh, probably not gonna like, but. Metriacanthosaurus. I think that's how you say it. See that? It's dusty. He has a slash mark on the side of him. And he looks pretty cool. Anyway, that's everything out of the entire bag. Hope you enjoyed the video. Like, subscribe. See you in the next one.